In lecture, I am going to discuss about how to install Rust programming language on Windows operating system. After that, running this code. So this code going to run. So first here in Google search box, write there Rust. Then you can get here Rust lang org site. So click on this site. Let's click on this get started. So if you scroll down, this is available for 32-bit operating system and 64-bit. So let's click on this 64-bit operating system. The size 8.5 MB. Let's click on this open. So in folder, then double click on this executor file. Then you can get here Rust Visual C++. Three options we have. Quick install via Visual Studio Community, manually install and don't install prerequisites. You can select anyone. So I'm going to select here first option. So first option that's so uh, selected here. Let's come there. Let's click on yes button. So here, click on this continue. So Visual Studio installer, this installing. Now these tools are selected, click on this and install. this place Visual Studio has been successfully installed. So let's click on this OK. And now Visual Studio that's opening. And here you can get this option. So you can see there. Or oh, this welcome to Rust. This will download the install. This is Rust here. And if I scroll down here you can see Cargo this all that's come there. Proceed the standard installers and customize. So first option going to select press enter. So this here or downloading the cargo clip rust dock. Rust is installed now. Great. To get started, you may be restart your current or cell. Press enter to continue. So press enter. And now I'm going to close this Visual Studio. And then after, let's open this place. Command prompt. Command prompt. And if I write there, Rust. C minus minus version. So you can get your Rust version 1.79 that install. After that, let's click on this plus and uh, here going to print the hello world using Rust. Save that, control S to save, going to save inside the desktop. So let's give here the file name hello.rs. For Rust, we need to give the extension RS. Click on this save. So on this text of hello.rs file that's created. After that, this here. 
move into the next row. If you write ls, then you can, ls is not working there, dir, then you can see here, this file starts come there. Okay, this all file, hello.rs is there. So now going to compile this. So let's write here Rust C hello.rs. Press enter. And if I here you can see the new file that's created, hello and hello.pdv. Two files that's created. If I write there dir, then you can see. So simply you need to write there hello. So when you press hello, hello world, that's just blank. Now, thereafter, let's add two number. Save that, control S to save. If you want, then you can give for the file name with unique name. So let's give here add dot rs. Add dot rs. Save that. Here you can see add file that's created. The same thing you need to write there Rust C add dot rs compile successfully. And if you are going to use dir command, then you can see add or uh, three files there. So you need to simply write there add. So sum of a and b 15 that's just blank. So this is the most uh, simplest way. We can here install Rust inside the Windows operating system and after that run this code. So I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.